My whole family did nothing. 2021 has been a crucial year in the life of Britney Spears. It was only until now that the princess of pop was able to speak out honestly and bluntly about the dire situation she is in, and also about the people who are to blame, her own family. And guys, it has been intense, so let's get into it. So just as a little bit of context, Britney has been in a conservatorship since 2008. This means that her father is in complete control of her professional and personal life. And this is only the tip of the iceberg. You guys probably know that Britney has a decisive hearing in June 2021. And in that hearing, she revealed some details about her conservatorship that are even more horrible than anyone was ever expecting. One of those things is that she has been medicated without her consent. She was made to have lithium, which was incapacitating for her and made her feel awful. But that's that's not even the worst part. Guys, Britney said that she was forced to use an IUD so she wouldn't be able to have babies. This is just a terrible breach of her reproductive rights and it's honestly so enraging and heartbreaking. All of that is already bad, but the fact that it's her own father who has made her go through all of this is just beyond me. He's the one who's supposed to love her the most and clearly his daughter's well-being comes last on his priority list. But what is the thing he actually cares about? Uh, to no one's surprise, his interest appears to be money. As the conservator of Britney, Jamie has earned literally millions. He gets $16,000 a month, uses Britney's money to pay for legal fees, he got money from Britney's tour, and he spends money on a luxurious $2,000 a month office. All of this is paid with the money that Britney has worked so hard to earn. So not only is Britney's father hurting her emotionally and even physically, but he's also making a lot of money in the meantime. But that's not the end of it. According to Britney, as her father made her life a living hell, he appeared to be in enjoying it. I cried on the phone for an hour and he loved every minute of it. And this, guys, is bad. This is a new level of psychotic behavior that we're still not aware of. How can you do this to your own daughter? But let's be real, even if we did know the extent of Britney's father's evilness towards his own daughter, we did know that he was to blame for the conservatorship. However, ever since Britney was able to speak out about what she's gone through, everyone started questioning the role of the rest of her family during these 13 years of suffering. And the things that have come out are mind-blowing. As you probably know, Jamie Lynn is Britney's 30-year-old sister. And what exactly does she have to say about the situation her sister is going through? Well, she has remained awfully quiet during these 13 years. But on June 28th, after Britney's hearing, Jamie Lynn finally had something to say. And you won't believe the cynicism. Jamie Lynn shared some of her thoughts on her Insta stories, and she started by saying that she hasn't addressed the situation because she didn't want to speak until Britney had her chance of speaking first. Apart from that, Jamie says that, before anything else, her main role in Britney's life is as her sister. I've made a very conscious choice in my life to only participate in her life as her sister, as an aunt to those boys. And guys, this is precisely what Jamie is failing to see. Brittany didn't need Jamie Lynn to be there for her as her younger sister or an aunt. She needed real help. But that's not everything that Jamie Lynn had to say. She continued her Insta story by claiming that she has never felt for her sister anything more than love, support, and adoration. Sadly, Jamie Lynn's supposed moral support was not enough for Brittany. And honestly, you guys, at this point, Brittany is ready to speak her truth. Now that she was able to pick her own lawyer and she can speak with more freedom, Brittany has been way more honest in her Instagram posts. On July 17th, she posted a picture with an eye-opening caption. Part of it said, There is nothing worse than when the people closest to you who never showed up for you post things in regards of your situation, whatever it may be, and speak righteously for support. There's nothing worse than that. How dare the people you love the most say anything at all? Do they even put a hand out to even lift me up at the time? How dare you make it public that now you care? Did you put your hand out when I was drowning? This was directed obviously at her family, but even more so at Jamie Lynn. And guys, this is only the beginning. In another post, Britney would go even stronger against Jamie Lynn, and she wrote, I don't like that my sister showed up at an awards show and performed my songs to remixes. My so-called support system hurt me deeply. But what exactly is Britney talking about? Well, it's about that time in 2017 that Jamie Lynn participated in a tribute to her sister and sang one of her songs. If you see the video, it is literally cringeworthy. Britney was in the audience, smiling, but you can easily tell that she's super uncomfortable. Because guys, at that point, not only was Britney being controlled in every single aspect of her personal and professional life, but she also had to witness Jamie Lynn taking ownership of the stage and the songs that belonged to her. That must have been painful. And while Britney struggled in the public, Jamie Lynn, well, she was enjoying her stage moment. 
she is my friend, my hero, my favorite pop star of all time, and everyone else's. This is really sad to watch, don't you think? Even more so because as it was meant to be a surprise for Britney, obviously nobody asked her if she was okay with Jamie Lynn singing her songs. And I don't know what you guys think about this, but for many people, it's obvious that Jamie Lynn is kind of resentful towards Britney. After all, it must not be easy to have the greatest pop star that has ever existed as a sister. Anyway, now that you know that this happened, we can move back to the Instagram posts. On July 18th, 2021, Jamie Lynn posted a mirror selfie on Instagram. The caption originally said, May the peace of the Lord be with you and your spirit. Shortly after, Brittany also posted a picture with the caption, May the Lord wrap your mean up in joy today. Both of them later changed their captions, but it was already too late and people had made screenshots. So the fight is already out there. And obviously you guys, everyone is taking Britney's side. The main thing that Britney's fans are mad about is that Jamie Lynn literally knew everything that was going on and never said anything to defend her own sister. But Jamie Lynn has an excuse for this too. Maybe I didn't support the way the public would like me to with a hashtag on a public platform, but I can assure you that I've supported my sister long before there was a hashtag and I'll support her long after. I don't know about you, but I really wonder what the support that Jamie Lynn gave consists of because Britney is clearly not feeling it. Anyway, once Britney shared how she feels about her sister, her fans are now coming after Jamie Lynn and the hate has been so bad that her comments are deactivated in most of her recent Instagram posts. But as you may expect, that doesn't stop the criticism from coming and Britney's fans are bashing Jamie Lynn on Twitter. Ah, waking up to see Jamie Lynn getting dragged as she should be. I just love this picture of Britney Spears and her sister Jamie Lynn. Seeing Britney fire shot at Jamie Lynn makes me happy because now there's no more speculation on if Jamie was in the right or wrong because Britney has literally shown us what's what. As you can see, there's no doubt that Britney's fans are really mad at Jamie Lynn. Even more so because according to some, Jamie Lynn only stayed quiet for so long because she was just enjoying her sister's money. Jamie Lynn has claimed that she has never received a dime from Britney and yeah, it looks like she's the only person from Britney's immediate family who's not on her payroll. However, in an article posted by The Sun, it was revealed that the cost condo that Jamie Lynn uses regularly to vacation actually belongs to Britney. When Britney's fans learned about this, they were not happy and their response was pretty savage. Failed actress and alleged musician, Jamie Lynn Spears has claimed she never took any of Britney Spears' money, but The Sun claims that they were given tax documents and they said that the $1 million Florida condo Jamie Lynn and the family vacations at was paid by Britney. Hashtag free Britney. So yeah it's clearly not the best moment to be Jamie Lynn. But are we really surprised that people are reacting this strongly to her? If you ask me, it's unacceptable that Jamie Lynn, who knew all of the details about Britney's conservatorship, never did anything to try and help her sister. Like, she clearly knew that Britney was being controlled in every aspect of her life and still chose to remain quiet? Some fans have helped Britney more than Jamie Lynn has. Anyway, you guys, now we know that Britney is not happy with her sister, but we're not done yet here. There's another member of Britney's family that has remained low profile during all of this, her mother, Lynn. <laughs> So what's exactly Lynn's involvement in her daughter's conservatorship? Well, obviously Lynn played along with her ex-husband for Britney's conservatorship back in 2008. According to her, she agreed to it because she thought that it would be the best for Britney, but we already know how that turned out. Anyway, even though Lynn allowed the conservatorship to happen, she's not legally a conservator herself. Why? Well, because as she told one of her family friends, she'd rather have Britney resenting her father than her. In addition to that, Lynn supposedly thought that the conservatorship would only be temporary. Well, more than a decade after the conservatorship started, Lynn apparently had second thoughts and she tried to help Britney end it in 2020 and even filed some legal documents on her daughter's behalf. At least she helped, right? I mean, she only waited for 12 years. Honestly, you guys, it looks like Lynn didn't put a lot of effort into her daughter's emotional well-being and I think Britney is not happy about that. In Britney's conservatorship hearing in June, Britney told the judge, I would honestly like to sue my family to be totally honest with you. And even if she didn't mention her mother explicitly, she was clearly not talking only about her father. So there you have it guys. It's really super sad. But at least Britney is able to speak now. During all these years of her conservatorship, she had to pretend to be happy while she was living a nightmare. After I've lied and told the whole world I'm okay and I'm happy, it's a lie. I thought I just maybe I said that enough, maybe I might become happy. Cause the next few months will be decisive in the future of Britney. And apparently the process won't be fast, but hopefully it will lead her to regain control of her personal life, her professional life, her money, and even her body. Because honestly, that's kind of the bare minimum for every human being to have. What do you guys think about everything that is going on with Britney? Let me know in the comments below.